lovers, it is Juice Wiz here, and I am here today with a Kingdom of Ash YA Chronicles subscription box unboxing. Oh my goodness, that was a mouthful. finally here. It was literally published and it's literally in my hands right now just underneath this box. I am so excited to unbox this box. My goodness. This technically marks that it's been over a year since I unboxed my first YA Chronicles box. My first YA Chronicles box was the Tower of Dawn box. It's so crazy to think that I got that box and then all of a sudden I made friends with the people of the YA Chronicles. I could decide to support them by buying a Sarah J Maas box and now look where we are. Like we're friends and that's really cool. So I kind of think that this marks a special occasion in that department, but also the fact that this is the final book in the Throne of Glass series, the seventh and the final book. I cannot believe that it's here and it's in my hands underneath the box. I can't contain this. I've got to unbox this bad boy for you guys right now and then I've got to start this almost a thousand page book because it needs to happen before spoilers come out. Let's do this! Oh wow. D no, this wasn't taped. Oh wow, it was just, this. It was just really hard to open. Cool blammo! So I need to find the spoiler cut. No, no, don't, don't look. Don't look, spoilery card first. Okay, I've got the bookmark. I just need to grab the spoilery card. Why are the spoilery cards under the book? Okay, after some digging, I have the spoilery card. The box is so heavy, I had to put it down for a second to show you guys the amazing art that has been featured this month. Oh my goodness. Like, I can get that this is a spoilery card, but I just, I'll interpret this as just a regular art print because that is awesome. I wanna quickly show you guys the bookmark that is Manon and Aelin on there, and I think that that's really cool. And then behind it, it says Kingdom of Ash, Throne of Glass, Seven because that's what it is. And then right over here on the spoiler card art, we have Rowan, Aelin, Manon, Dorian, Lysandra, and Adion. Oh, my babies, they look so cute. It looks absolutely cute without looking too cheesy, if that makes sense. So I like that. I'm gonna put this down for now until I need help. Next of all in this box, I spot something from Ink and Wonder. Guys, if you have no idea, I absolutely love Ink and Wonder stuff. I actually recently ordered like nine bookmarks from them. Here are two that I've ordered from them. This isn't a part of the unboxing, but I thought I'd show you. Both of these are Sarah J Mass related. I just picked them off of my Throne of Glass shelf. And I have a favorite one and I have a non one. Sorry, I just thought I'd share them because they're just so cute. But you get my drift. Like, Ink Wonder is awesome. From what I can tell, this is a tote bag from them. I am so excited about this. Oh my goodness. Wait. Oh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, it's Lysandra! It's, it's, it's Lysandra! Her in the sea monster form, oh my goodness, this is so beautiful! And it's so colorful too, it's so vivid, it's so vivid, it's a double rainbow! Does anybody remember that? Please let me know if you're as old as me and if you remember that. Let's get the heavy box back into the picture here. Okay, I don't want to pick the books out first, but almost everything is like sandwiched in between the books, so I'm just gonna try to like slide them out. Do your side on your night like this. Do your try on your night like this. Put some spotlight on this. I'm not Celine Dion, nor is that song sung by Celine Dion. Why am I trying to put her accent on? My goodness. Okay, the next thing that I picked up from the box is this build your own stag type of thing. This is seriously creative. I need to learn how to make it so I can display it on my throne of glass shelf, but I am so satisfied with this. I cannot wait to try to build this. But let's be realistic. I can't wait to butcher it because I am really bad at building things. The next thing I'm gonna pick up out of the box is something that is wrapped. And it says Book of Shadows Studios presents. Okay, so my friend Ali at the Wire Chronicles, she really loves Book of Shadows Studio merchandise and she's been raving about it and she's been very excited about this one in particular and I haven't seen it yet. Now's the moment of truth. I'm gonna see it. I'm going to check and see whether it's worth the hype or not. Let's open this. Oh my goodness. To show you guys what I just opened. That, that is beautiful. Oh wow. To whatever end, Karanam. If you guys couldn't see it, if you guys couldn't tell that that looks like Aelin and Rowan, I am so overwhelmed by how beautiful this is. It's kind of like a little pop-up art type of thing. No, not really pop-up art. Like, I, I don't really know how to describe this, but this is beautiful. And apparently Book of Shadows Studios do more of these for bookish characters, which is really cool. And I'm just excited to have one of Aelin and Rowan. I think that that's really awesome. This is better than I expected it to be. Like, I've seen some of their work, but 
this is beautiful. I love it. Seriously, this box is still heavy. It's probably because of the book. I mean, you've got to expect weight when both books are almost a thousand pages. So the next things we have are prints. Okie dokie, we have three. Ah, that's, that's, that's gonna, that's gonna scar. What I was trying to say is, okie dokie, we have three. Three. Okay, so first of all, we're gonna state the obvious here. Aelin and Rowan. Like, the main, the main ship of the series. And I'ma be real, I just want their happily ever after to happen because Empire Storms... Oh boy, yeah, let's not talk about that. Then over here, we have Manon and Dorian. And let's be real, from this photo, we already know that they're ready to steam things up, you know? Yeah, yeah? Uh, okay, my demisexual mind can't handle that. And then last but not least out of the three prints is my ultimate ship that I will go down with, okay? Like, Kayla and Irene, my OTP of the series. You guys, you can't change my mind, okay? My original OTP of the series was Kaylena, and then I moved on to Manon and Dorian for some reason. Like, I, I don't know why. But then all of a sudden, my heart leapt out of my chest when I started reading Tower of Dawn, and I realized that I needed this to happen. And this was before they were canon, okay? As soon as I started the book, like around 100 pages in, I'm like, they need to happen. And I was crying. I was. I was sobbing at the possibility that they would possibly never happen. I was ready to read fan fiction, okay? I don't do that. Like, I, 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 I never grew up with fan fiction, but I was ready to read fan fiction about them. It turns out I didn't have to because, like, my dreams came true. And the amazing artist that designed these prints was Megan G on books. Oh my goodness, I love your stuff, Megan. Seriously, thank you once again for your amazing art. I am just so excited to hang these somewhere. I need to put my art somewhere. I have too many prints and I just need to put them somewhere in my room. But then obviously, like, I put Funko Pops all over my room, but not art. I need to change it up a bit. My room's a mess at the moment. These ways you need to get it together. I'm pretty sure that this is going to be the final item before I get onto the monsters that are the books. And that, my friends, is a natural soy wax candle by the book hangover, and it is titled Terrison. Okay, now we need to smell this. Oh my goodness. This one lived up to the hype. And the scent is of pomegranate, sugar, apple, mint, and malt. I can smell all of those in here. And you can't go wrong with green and gold unless that's blue and gold. No, no, it looks more like a greeny. Yeah, teal. We'll, we'll settle for like a tealish and gold. But yeah, that is amazing. Probably the best candle I've received from the book hangover. Oh man, Beck, you're amazing. And then we come to the final two items, the, the items we've been waiting for. The first one being the paperback of... Kingdom of Ash by Sarah J Mass. Oh boy, that's a chunker. I can't believe I, I can't believe I'm holding this in my hands right now. Wow, it makes a big slap noise. I don't know, I just wanted to keep doing that. But if you haven't seen the UK edition yet, here it is in all of its glory. I think that it looks really cool. And then behind the book, you've got Aelin in her dress. So yeah, that's the UK edition. And then finally, we have the US edition. Yeah! Woo! 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 Yep! Okay, wow, it's it's gold. It's it's real gold. It's it's gold. It's golden. Here's the behemoth that is the US edition of Throne of Glass by Sarah J. Mass. And apparently when you take the dust jacket off, it has Sarah J. Mass's signature with a sword on it, and I think that that's really cool. Oh my goodness, like I just I, I can't. I honestly just I can't even with this. This is just amazing. Does it make a big slap sound when I do this? Yeah, it does. Oh wow. Like I it just feels so official. That's a that's a big page count. Oh wow. I have the final book on my hands now. This is amazing. I'm, I don't even know if I'm able to do this, but like here are all the goodies that I received in this box today. And I have to say that I am more than satisfied with the turnout of this box. And I am so sad that this is the last ever Throne of Glass box that I will receive from the Wyatt Chronicles because this is the last Throne of Glass book. So yeah, to sum up my feelings, I am very excited and truly devastated at the same time that this is happening. The final book, you know, it's here. And I'm not ready for it to destroy me, but I know it will. I got a lot of reading to do, so without further ado, I'm gonna start the book and I'm gonna finish this video today. If you wanna purchase this or any box from the YA Chronicles, including a Kingdom of Ash goodies box, if you already have the Kingdom of Ash book, and if you're wanting to grab a goodies only box, I'm pretty sure they're selling those. So yeah, go check out the YA Chronicles. Their link is down in the description so you can do so. And if you want to, you can follow me on my social medias. I'm at Books on Twitter and Instagram, and I'm also a Goodreads. That's www.goodreads.com slash gswizzle. I love you book lovers and I will see you later. Peace.